So you should know by now, unless plans change, when I drop a scoop, it's going to happen. Whether it's movies, whether it's Dragon Ball, whether it's wrestling. On this channel, I have been able to reveal not one, but five, actually six full movie plots for films that were nowhere to be found on 4chan, Reddit, anywhere before there was even a trailer on this channel, World of Geekdom. I've also given you throughout the years, once in a while, some wrestling scoops. I'm not a wrestling YouTuber. I'm not like a, a wrestling writer. I'm not like Sean Ross Sapp or these guys that always go in to get scoops. But I've had my fair share and I've been right on many of them. And then of course there's Dragon Ball. But let's not talk about that right now. Let's talk about the WrestleMania 40 main events. Now, this has now been corroborated by a few other news sites, including Wrestling Observer and I believe Fightful, that the WrestleMania 40 main events, obviously, if you've been subscribing to this channel, you heard me tell you, actually, when WrestleMania 39 ended, that they were going to go with a Roman Reigns-Cody Rhodes rematch for WrestleMania 40, and that this time Cody was going to win. He fails the first time, but the second time he gets it. With the story, of course, following the same journey that his father, the American Dream Dusty Rhodes, went on, where he couldn't beat Ric Flair at Starcade 84, but at Starcade 85, he was able to finally win. Now, of course, after Starcade, they took the belt off him for some shenanigans, but nevertheless, he still got the title. That's the story they're going with. Oftentimes, Shawn Michaels, WrestleMania 11, he goes for the title, he loses. WrestleMania 12, he gets it. Sometimes you have to fall to pick yourself back up, and that is the story. And we can't have Cody Rhodes not go through some hard times. So I told y'all that then, and I told y'all a couple months ago that this was the plan for Mania. Roman Reigns, Cody Rhodes for the Undisputed Universal title. Well, now... CM Punk versus Seth Rollins for the World Heavyweight title. That's the main event of night one of WrestleMania. This, I dropped it at 4 p.m. on the 27th. That's two days ago. 4 p.m. before Raw. That afternoon, I dropped the scoop. CM Punk versus Seth Rollins for a World Heavyweight title and Roman Reigns, Cody Rhodes for the Undisputed Universal title. And there were people who, after, huh, and it just makes me laugh when somebody tries to argue with me. There were people who swore up and down that Seth Rollins' behavior after seeing CM Punk was a shoot. First of all, Seth Rollins is a professional, and he knows that from when you leave that curtain to when you act, we go back through the curtain... You are in character. It's not Colby Lopez. You understand what I'm saying? It's Seth Rollins. Not Colby Lopez, Seth Rollins. He stops being Seth Rollins when he goes through the curtain in the back. Then he goes back to being Colby Lopez. Then we found out from Meltzer that the guys in the ring knew ahead of time that Punk was coming in. So the guys in the main event knew. Triple H probably told Seth Rollins, listen, man, when he comes out, your program with him for Mania, make sure that you, you know, you know, really like throw a fit, you know what I'm saying? And there we go. And that's what he did. And yet people bought it. Now, I'm not laughing at the people who bought it, although it's annoying that people try to question me on it, but I'm happy that they're so gullible because it means that wrestling fans, to a degree, still believe. And that's okay. But on Monday's Raw, Seth Rollins referred to CM Punk as being a hypocrite. And that's obviously going to lead to the reveal of CM Punk's true motives for coming back to WWE, which I think is the long-term story. That promo from Monday, I wasn't a fan of it. Did a video about it. However... It's only the first chapter. And you know how Triple H is. He takes his time with these angles. They have been teasing Bailey getting turned on by damage control since what? February or March? 
they teased the Bray Wyatt, rest in peace Bray Wyatt, but when Bray Wyatt came back in September, they dragged on that Uncle Howdy thing for months, and to this day, and unfortunately he's no longer with us, we have not, we don't know what's going to happen with that. I mean, he's gone, so it doesn't matter anymore, but it took him a long time before actually getting progression of that story. Triple H likes to take his time, is what I'm trying to tell you. So I think this is just chapter one. But yes, CM Punk and Seth Rollins are going to be headlining night one because you're going to have CM Punk finally getting to close the show at WrestleMania because he's always wanted to end a WrestleMania. He'll be ending night one. No, it's not night two. I'm sure his ego wants it to be night two and his desire to be the top guy. He said it in his interview with Colt Cabana on the Art of Wrestling podcast back in 2015. Which, by the way, the anniversary of that was a couple days ago, yo. Isn't that weird? Isn't that weird timing? But yes, yeah, CM Punk, Seth Rollins. Now remember, I discussed, and I also told y'all that Jimmy Uso versus Jey Uso would be happening at Mania 40. Oh, they, they can't keep them apart that long. Jey Uso goes to Raw. Oops. Maybe they can. And that's going to happen. At WrestleMania 40. Mark my words. Now, CM Punk will get to close the show working with Seth Rollins. Like I said, several news sites have already reported on this. Now, I'm not sure if CM Punk is actually going to win that title or not. But, we do know that WWE is already thinking about putting him against Roman Reigns down the road. While this may happen prior to WrestleMania at the Elimination Chamber show, if they want to get that to get a big eyeballs on, like with the Sami Zayn thing, I guess they could go with that. But I think, and I could be wrong, I think it'll be after WrestleMania. January's Royal Rumble is going to be headlined by Randy Orton versus Roman Reigns. Besides, of course, Cody versus, you know, or Cody winning the Rumble, I'm sorry, which he probably will win the men's rumble Randy Orton versus Roman Reigns is your match for the Royal Rumble Randy Orton's going to Smackdown this week to begin his apex predator-esque hunt of the bloodline you got Jimmy Uso there we got Solo there Heyman and of course Roman Reigns I do think they're going to have to bring in some new members at some point to the bloodline you know, like Jacob Fatu and some of the guys that are out there. But CM Punk, Seth Rollins, night one. That's good. That's a good main event. Besides that, there'll be other matches. Now, I did say that Drew versus Seth was planned. And it was. There was a plan for them to do Drew versus Seth at WrestleMania. We got that at the Saudi show. Plans changed. I'm not saying that CM Punk was the cause of those plans changing. I know some folks thought that Drew was pissed off because he might have lost his WrestleMania spot to CM Punk. Don't know if that's true either. But, and that is a possibility without question. But, to me, CM Punk, Seth Rollins is a bigger match. Obviously, Rollins made those comments about Punk, you know, calling him a cancer and all that. And he called him a hypocrite literally on TV. So... That's the beginning of the tease. There's my Raid Shadow Legends. Yes, I actually play the game, folks. Unlike the fakers on YouTube, I actually play the game that I've done promos for. Oh, you don't play that game. I actually do. It ain't that good of a game. It's not a bad game, though. It's a hell of a lot better than a lot of other mobile games. But the point is that this CM Punk Seth Rollins thing, man, it's been built up. Yes, Seth does not like Punk. I get it. That's okay, because Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels got into a fist fight and were working together seven weeks later. This happens, man. People can work together if you, even if you don't like the guy you're working with. I think it'll be fine. Hype. Get ready now, because I'll be proven right in just a few weeks. Watch. <laughs> 